Hey guys, here to uh, do an update on the Franken pump. Just recently got in a 500 watt 36 volt power supply. I also had to get a new ESC. This ESC is rated for up to 14S. For those of you who aren't in the hobby RC world, uh, 14S basically equates to around 58 to 60 volts. Uh, it's the number of maximum batteries you can have in series. Uh, to create a battery pack. I had only ESCs that went up to, I'm wanting to say, 8S. That probably would have been fine for a 36 volt power supply, but we want to kind of take this pump to the max. So I've got a 48 volt power supply. I'll do uh, another test when that comes in. And uh, we can see how fast we can make this pump go. So we have the same setup as before five gallon bucket filled with five ish gallons of water the bulkhead at the bottom with the pump connected up to that bulkhead now this ESC is got a really soft start so I'm gonna go ahead and start the pump let it spin up and recirculate into this bucket right here and then once it reaches full speed I'll swap the hose and then we'll start timing uh, how we calculate our gallons per hour is we take a measurement of how long it takes to move that five-ish gallons of water from this bucket to the other bucket and then we take 3600 which is the number of seconds in an hour and divide that by our recorded time from there we take that number and multiply that by five gallons and we should get roughly an approximation of gallons per hour for those metric folks take that gallon per hour and multiply that by 3.785 and you'll get your liters per hour. So here we go. I'm gonna go ahead and spin it up. It sounds a lot faster as you can probably here in the video. Alrighty. Here we go. And that's it. So you can see in this bucket, I had to uh, put some scrap material down over the bulkhead to keep it from vortexing. This pump likes to move a lot of water. I will insert the calculated gallons per hour after the break. <laughs> 